question six. Gradient, first thing, of the tangent to C at the point P. Okay, I'll try and squeeze it in over here, maybe, or I might put it underneath. So, we need gradient, we need dy dx at P, <coughs> so dx dt is equal to 2at, isn't it? And dy dt is equal to 2a. So dy dx then equals uh, this divided by that. So it's 1 over t. So the two a's will cancel. Uh, at p, dy dx when t is equal to the parameter p, uh, it's 1 over p. So that's part one. Tangent to C at P. The equation of the tangent then. So at P, which is a t squared, a p squared rather, two a p y minus two a p is equal to the gradient. Uh, x minus the x coordinate p. Okay. Right, so y is equal to 1 over px minus ap plus, plus ap then is the equation of the tangent at p. Gradient of pq Q is equal to a q squared to a q. So gradient of p q is equal to y minus that is two a q minus p, and then over the increase in x from p to q, a q squared minus a p squared. A Q minus P cancels from this when you uh, complete the square here. So you're left with 2 over P plus Q, or Q plus P, it's the same thing. Because the Q minus P is a factor in here, this quadratic, <coughs> so to speak. So that's the gradient. Now, as Q tends to P, we'll get the tangent at uh, the point. So Q tends to P will get gradient at P. Uh, Q tends to P, we get 2 over 2P, 1 over P. That's it.